today Molly and I have come out to a place called Formby Point which is a stretch of coastline on the west coast of England between Liverpool and Southport and it's beautiful this is one of those it's very popular so a lot of people about but it's one of those stretches of coastline that reminds you of coastlines when you were a kid lots and lots of sand dunes great views come on Molly Molly's lagging a bit behind it's hard work for her to walk in the sand it's very very windy so I hope it doesn't affect the sound too much I'm just walking up the sand dunes now and the sea has just come into view this reminds me of when I was a kid you remember when you were a kid and you were going to the seaside and you were always anxious and always waiting for that first glimpse of sea and that real rush you got when you got a glimpse of it out of the car window in the distance and we're now reaching the end of the sand dunes and pretty soon we're going to drop down onto the beach the sea is crashing in there aren't many people about a couple of people with dogs family having a picnic it's lovely there's nothing like the seaside is there especially on a nice day and we're blessed with a beautiful afternoon at National Trust we are actually north by about two or three miles of Crosby Beach and Crosby Beach is where Anthony Gormley has got an installation of a hundred men made out of steel dotted about on the beach and it's fab and I did a video of that oh, two or three years ago I'll put a link to it in the description because that is somewhere you really need to go come on oh you're here come on Mol sound of the seagulls there's nothing like the seaside we're just coming out to the sand dunes the beautiful beautiful sand dunes and we're coming onto the beach you know and I look along and I can see people to my left quite a few people stretching into the distance I can see Liverpool in the distance I can see Blackpool Tower to my right let's have a walk down to the sea We don't come to the seaside anywhere near enough because we always seem to make our, our way up north we go to the Lake District or into Yorkshire or just discovering the land round about where we live but this is nice it does you so good to come to the seaside every now and again <coughs> this is pretty much unadulterated there's no kiss me quit hats or donkeys or anything like that it's just a stretch of beach pretty pristine there's no litter there's no nothing on it and then it's backed by these beautiful sand dunes Formby Point if you're in the UK get here but if you are in the UK go over to Crosby Beach and view the installation and it's called Another Place by Anthony Gormley look it up 
it's dramatic and it's near Liverpool so you can see the boats coming in and out I can see a gas rig over there on the sea I could walk forever but poor little Molly her legs will be suffering she's still behind me she's still trotting along she's not a big one for beach you get some dogs that on a beach you let them go and they go absolutely mental don't they? they just get this brain freeze thing where they just dart about like lunatics but Molly it isn't she's even when she was younger uh, there is a, a clip on the other video I was talking about where it shows her running I've slowed it down and it wasn't that long ago but she doesn't run like that anymore I think the tide might be coming in actually because it's kind of if I stand here I can actually tell it's coming closer and closer to my feet nothing over there but Ireland and then beyond Ireland nothing over there till America see the lifeguard hut in the distance about a quarter of a mile away and they've got lots of these little I'll see if I can see one on the way back these little wooden walkways that you get to beaches through the sand really kind of an old-fashioned traditional thing these lovely wooden walkways and they're always bleached by the sun aren't they and a little bit rickety here and there it's very evocative, it always just reminds you of when you were young. When you were young and when you were carefree. And there were no worries and we didn't have all this nonsense that's going on in the world. Life was just candy floss and sand dunes. Would that it was like that again. This is fabulous, sitting in the sand dunes out of the wind, just the sun beating down on us. Looking through the sand dunes, I can see the wooden boardwalk down to the beach. I can see the sea blue between the sand dunes. It's fabulous. Get out into the sand, into the, get to the coast, and especially if you've got somewhere that's away from the madding crowds. Molly's behind me in the shade. I can hear her panting, she needs a drink of water. We're going to sit here for a bit and then we're going to make our way back to the car and go home and chill. I hope we had a nice day. I hope you've been able to get out into the sun at some point. Please subscribe and do us a favour, make an old man very happy. Peace and love. <laughs>